So this is going to be called The Brief. Um, it's The Brief because it's very brief. Go figure, right? In this particular brief, a little longer, just because I get to explain of what the uh, Summer 17 3-pack is. Uh, and where I'm planning to go with this for the next actual couple months. Uh, currently working on a few things here. And I just wanted to test it out. So, um, if you haven't already seen, uh, definitely I'll put a link on the screen here. So, for years, I've been writing uh, poetry, actually. Uh, some of my poetry goes back to, I believe, my freshman year of high school. So, it's been a little over 10 years. <clears throat> and if anyone got to know this kid, I am very, very patient and to a very unique detail. So when it comes down to my work, I do a lot of research and a lot of, uh, take a lot of opportunity of really looking into live performances, literature, published books, um, all around poetry. And so from everything I was taught in high school all the way to what I have been experiencing to today, um, it really is a melting pot of ideas, of structure, of delivery, and it's something I've always wanted to share. So not until now that I started looking into how to share it, um, I figured, you know, why not? So what we stand today is where I've wanted to put it at. So um, my weird thing about life is that I look at it in, in threes. So when I was thinking about releasing Evolution of Game, I wanted to see how I could deliver this in a way that I'm familiar with and with my name, the kid, I revert back to a state of of nostalgia and um, freedom. So when it came down to all of it, I thought if Jordan could do it, why not me? So that's the reason for the Summer 3 Pack, uh, Summer 17 3 Pack. Uh, I've been around some of the most unusual individuals when it comes down to shoes. And major shout out to one particular sneakerhead that I've been very honored to hang around with and really see what that looks like. And I continue to really enjoy that and see how that speaks to um, the kid. Next two months, two more entries, two more briefs. Um, keep a lock on this channel for sure to see those updates. The evolution of game is fairly simple. <laughs> it is the perspective of a nerd. Um, finally having the chance to be 100 to himself and 100 to that individual. It's a bit of a piece that takes a lot uh, of work and a lot of understanding. So if you haven't really understood it, I definitely recommend going back to it a couple more times. And the only reason why it's because it's a very unique piece that I believe that a lot of people would be able to understand and really comprehend and seek uh, a middle ground to what I was going with. Um, believe it or not, the evolution of game is a piece that took me almost three years to really put together. And if it seems kind of uh, immature and amateur, it, it really is meant to be. But if you see it as its structure, it takes a lot. Major shout out to uh, Hakeem B for helping me out with that. I needed another perspective. And that's the one thing about work when it comes down to the arts that I find um, very useful. It's collaborative. And even taking um, critiques and opportunities to really cut and, and seek a better um, level of perfection. If you have not seen this man, if you have not heard some of his work, a lot of that information is going to be in the link below. So I wanted to make sure I give a lot of shout out to those individuals who influenced me. Because um, as a kid, that's all you get. Get a lot of people to influence you. You are a piece of everyone else. Yeah, you sure do develop to become your own individual, but you have essence of people who you've met in your life that really shaped you. So this evolution of game, how to talk to an individual that you're attracted to, it's always been that case of like, well, everyone wants to go ahead and say, I want a person who's honest and true to themselves. Well, that may be something you're going to get. I really look into a lot of my 
art, a lot of my history, a lot of the influences in my life, a lot of my nerdiness, my complete geek world. So uh, that's the way I want to share it to everyone. That being said, I've always wanted to make sure that there's this way of communicating, kind of continuing on this art aspect and through my art, have a dialogue because I love talking to people and I love seeing what other people's ideas are. And if this piece and those two that come after um, offer a voice, then so be it. I really am grateful for those who have seen it, um, those who have shared it, and those who are still waiting. Please, 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 check it out. Let me know on that video in the comments below what you guys think. But on this brief, the overview, seeing what the next couple months would be, the two more pieces are coming through, a little bit of where I'm coming from and the work to be, well, let's end it with a question. So for you guys who are watching this now and seeing what that looks like, and if you've already watched the video, come on back here or on Facebook or on Twitter. Um, that information is on the link below as well. The question is for today with this brief, if there is one movie line that you can introduce yourself as to that other person, what would that be? Have fun with it, guys. See you next time.